all right we are back i have yogurt seems like a lot's happened around here what hasn't happened this area is where Tevinter Magisters destroyed Arlathan City centuries ago. Whole lot of blood magic during the war. What about now? Whatever Solus did stirred up everything again. The old blood magic from the war never went away. Ancient relics appear out of thin air, ruins float. It's like an old wound that never healed. And now it's bleeding again. Let's see if we can figure this out. I'm on it. What a view. That was the capital city, Arlathan. This is what's left of it after the war. I don't imagine it floated back in the day. Okay, we're continuing. Look at that. It's over here. Nothing? Okay. What's this? What's this? Nothing. Just the light. Log carving. Hmm. Oh. Ah. Shortcut. Nice. Currently inaccessible. Oh. oh. Ooh, what's this? No. Want to explore? Hey. No. Sorry, I had to ban somebody from chat. Oh, I did hala. Yeah, I think I cannot ex. Oh, what's this? Giant owl. Must be something to this. 
Hmm. What the heck? Whole forest is weird. Here goes nothing. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> Are you shooting me? Woohoo. Okay, what did you do then? Uh, okay, re rela relax. Okay, this looks climbable, but it's not. Hmm. So it was just for the like, codex entry? Alright. I guess we have to come back here later. You sure you're up for this? I'm fine. Couldn't sit so much longer. Then let's go. I've never seen fog this thick in Demetta's Crossing. isn't right. The dock usually has people bringing goods to market, bartering and shouting. It's always busy. Something happened here. Stay sharp. The dock spawn. Too quiet. Where is everybody? I have a bad feeling that what this is. where are you going? Where is this way? I'm exploring! Be right there. Mm hmm. Oh, that's a nice spot to sit. Oh, I got something. Oh, I, I, you can get stuff, I guess. Oh. That's not sure if it's worth it because it's market day. People should be out selling eggs and buying bread. But everything's just abandoned. They barricaded the main entrance into town. To keep something out? No. To keep something in. Hmm. Ah, the classic Dragon Age store. Love it. Let anyone out. Oh. You okay? What happened here? Let's see, Luke. Okay. Listen to the mayor. 
Hello? I don't think he can hear us. Oh, goodness. Ah. We'll be rewarded. All of us. Uh huh. No, you can't leave. All right. Hey, can you hear me? Just stay here and everything will be fine. Mm hmm. Everything looks amazing. Love what you've Everyone done with the place. Someone used powerful magic to dominate the minds of these villagers. Uh. What the fuck is this? The town square. We need to search for survivors. Let's see what we can find. Fan out. This is Adeline. I knew her. She was a farmer. Sold spices to us. The best in Arlathan. I can't believe this happened. on the roof the uh, blight must have lifted it up there of course the blight yes this blight is weird ever seen anything like it never Light's usually dead, static. This is oh. alive. Uh, I think the game crashed. Video card has been physically removed from the system. No, it has not been physically removed from the system. The game just fucking crashed because I was holding down the arrow button too long. I guess. Okay, let's try this again. Ivers. Okay. Let's see what we can find. Fan out. That's fine. Uh, do you quick save? How do you quick save? Let's uh, look at that because uh, I don't want this to happen again. Mm. There is no quick save? There is no quick save. There is no quick save. Okay. Fuck. Is that an Aravel on the roof? The blight must have lifted it up there. This is Adeline. I knew her. She was a farmer. Sold spices to us. The best in all of them. I can't believe this happened. This blight is weird. Ever seen anything like it? Never. Blight's usually dead. Static. But this is alive. Okay, let's save before we do this again. Yep. Yep. Okay, let's keep going. Might be more survivors. Uh okay, that was pointless. Thank you. At least the auto save knock on wood. Oh. What was that? 
Something big. Stay sharp. The auto save seems to be very forgiving. Over there, two more survivors. Hey, what's going on here? Find the veil jumpers. Bring them to the mayor. They're talking about Jahel and Milva. They said bring them to the mayor. If we find the mayor, then maybe we'll find your friends. Why were they looking for bail jumpers? What did the mayor want with them? A sinkhole. But how? Careful not to slip. That's the deep roads down there. Oh, really? Where did dark spawn come from? Look, more people. Must round up him. Must get him. <laughs> Got anything to say? Okay. The mayor? No. Melva. That's one of your fellow veil jumpers. Laura. Jahel, he's alive. Belara. We're we're going to help you. We'll get you down to hell. No. Ugh. Listen. The gods. The gods have returned. No shit. I saw them. I heard their voices. The gods did this? A blood ritual to release the blight. In the villagers. They said they needed power. Valara. Be careful. Hmm. Help me, anyone. The mayor. Finding loot and secrets. Come on, that sounds close. No. That's a dragon. That is a dragon. A dragon. Here. Don't, 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 please. Hey. Why would you do that? <laughs> Bro, you're level three. <laughs>
I know you. You're the mayor of this town. The village. The people. Are they, uh... Blighted. Dead. All of them. You gave them to the gods, didn't you? Didn't you? They were in my head. Infecting my thoughts. They made me do it. Please, help me. You killed those people. You betrayed your own town. No, I, I didn't. I was tricked. Manipulated. I tried to protect people. You have to believe me. The gods told me to lure the Veil Jumpers to the center of town. The others were to be rounded up and kept safe. They would be the first to witness the glory of Gilanane's new creation. She showed me gold. So much gold. What the fuck is that and where can I get one? Uh, you get one by playing Velgard Backbridge. <laughs> gold, all this for greed. All this for gold? The villagers, the Veil Jumpers, the Blights everywhere. Demetta's Crossing is dead because of your greed. Uh, I, I didn't know. You don't understand what it was like to hear those voices. The gods exploited his greed and fear. I'm supposed to feel sorry for him? I say we leave him right here. But I'll die. The blights everywhere. What if the dragon comes back? If we let you go, you'll run straight back to the gods. They were in his head. Their influence might linger. I understand what they do now. I won't be tempted again, I swear. Rook? Save him, I guess. Let's get him out of there. What? This entire village is dead because of him. I know. Then why spare him? We aren't killers. We don't kill people, not like this. We're not murderers. We're not like the gods. Thank you. I didn't ask for your gratitude. Then, if I may offer some advice. Steal yourself. I felt their power. The promises they make, it, it's irresistible. Then try harder next time. Don't make me regret saving you. Yes, of course. But you should be worried about the rest of the world. Or this will be our future. The fade had opened, oh. and the gods were free. Thanks to Solus, they'd woken up to find their empire, their subjects, even their fellow gods, all gone. But they still had the power of the Blight, and corrupting a village was just the start. They made plans to tap more of the Blight, all of it, to rebuild their empire. As a path to power, it had its costs. And everyone would pay for it. Mm. Great. Sounds good. Fast travel. Press M to open your map. During the game, you will open up fast travel beacons, which also have are also save checkpoints. Ah. Whoa, whoa, right. Relax. Can I go there now? No. Inaccessible. Oh yeah, open the map, they said. Ah. I can just fast travel here. Cool, cool, cool. Even though it's very close, so I don't really need to, but... You get any new stock? Bits and bobs for just the right price. P 
appearance. Till next time. Hello. Did you find our scouts? They're dead. I'm sorry. Elgrinon and Gilanane sacrificed them in some kind of ritual. Creators. What about the rest of the village? The ritual spread blight everywhere. The entire village was overrun. The few who survived are controlled by blood magic. Their minds are gone. Elgrinon and Gilanane use them like puppets. There she is. It was a show of force. They will not rest until you are on your knees, fearful, cowering, helpless in the face of such power. Lady Morrigan? Tis simply Morrigan to you, Scout Harding. What a pleasure to see you again. Rook, this is Morrigan, an old acquaintance. I thought she could help. Morrigan helped the Inquisition when Varric and I were part of it. She knew more about ancient magic than anyone, except Solus. Twas both pleasure and necessity to help then, as it is now. Stopping Elganon and Gilanane shall require many hands. Maybe she does have multiple titums. <laughs> That's why she has multiple bras. You don't know. Who are you? I mean, we know who she is, but we want to ask. So, who are you exactly? I have borne many appellations. Advisor to Orle, Witch of the Wilds, Friend to the Inquisition. My place here, however, is but a humble advisor on matters arcane. Witch of the Wilds? An honorific, born of rumor and exaggeration. The fearsome reputations of your opponents, however, are duly earned. This dark turn of events shall only become worse. That sounds bad. I was hoping what we saw at Demetta's Crossing would be the worst of it. Tis but the start, I fear, and ignorance provides a feeble shield. Right. What can you tell us? As dangerous as Solus himself may be, his imprisonment of the gods was just. To leave them unchecked would have been the very end of Thedas. So you know the Dread Wolf? Just to be clear, you know your old friend Solus is actually the Dread Wolf. So I have come to learn. It rather explains how he knew such a great deal of ancient elven history, and why he became so vexed when I attempted to explain it to him. Whilst I cannot claim the same depth of knowledge, the knowledge I do possess is yours for the asking. I hope it helps. For all we know, the entire world will look like Demetta's Crossing once the gods are through. We caused this. This is our fault. When we interrupted Solus's ritual, the gods escaped. Would those feelings not be better used to put things right? But how? Set aside your notions of godhood and see them for the ancient, powerful mages they are. Standing against them shall require serious magic of your own. When you interrupted the Dreadwolf's ritual, did you happen across any of the tools he used? He had a dagger, but it got lost in the chaos. Then you would do well to find it. It is better in your hands than those of the gods. Is there anything else Solus might have had that could help us? We're in his, well, he calls it the Lighthouse. Ah, yes. The legendary sanctum of the Dreadwolf. Tis said his Illuvian... The Viravas could travel to any other Illuvian of his choosing. That's not how it works right now. It only goes to Arlithan. I can take a look at it. Maybe fix it, even. I know Illuvians better than most. Any help you can offer, we'd appreciate. If Illuvians even work the same way, all the magic is different now. Our gods are back. Our gods! And they're killing people and blinding the world. How do we stand up against that? We work together. None of us can do this alone. 
but we can stop them together. Bolara, you're one of the only people in the world who can get our Alluvian working. Harding can track down the Lyrium Dagger, and Nev can spot any clues we might miss that give us more information. Let's get to work. There's a lot of fight ahead of us. Indeed. Prepare yourselves well and have a care in your choices. These are the times in which legends are born or slain. In this battle, I shall render whatever assistance I am able. Right. Let's move. Uh. Rewards, 900 XP. Bond increased, bond increased, yeah. Oh, wow. You can do this, Lace. It's gotta be done. Level five. Okay. Okay, ugh. This is so confusing. Why don't you just... Let me... Mm. Damage this barrier, sure. This looks more useful. Do you have any skills? No. Remember this place? Good memories. What's this? Maybe this giant door is something. No? Okay. Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. I should have taken the shot. That would have made things worse. You don't know that. All you have are guesses. We're up against something unfamiliar, working with more rumors than facts. Of course that's all I have. I should have taken the shot. We all carry blame. You didn't take the shot. I destroyed the statue. Who do you want to blame more for the outcome? We all did what we thought was best in the moment. And look where it got us. Tried to stop the world from being swallowed by chaos, and now it might be swallowed by chaos anyway. Elven gods escape from their prison, Solus is in your head, and we're scrambling to figure out what to do. And Varric? Varric knew the risks. He knew what it might cost. We're still standing. The fight's not over. You know, I like that about you, Lace. You don't stop fighting, you push for answers and action, while I can get stuck on questions forever. Well, we need someone who can put the pieces of the puzzle together. We're fighting the unknown. Exactly. Everyone has a part to play. Varric brought us together because of our strengths. He wanted a team he could rely on. We have to be that team. Play to our strengths. And rely on each other. I think I can manage that. Then let's find Solus's dagger. It'll be a start. All right. Look. There's magic lingering in the spot. Strong. Old. The dagger was here. Something took it. Oh shit. Dark spawn. Oh no, what if it took the dagger? It took Only the dagger. Way to find out. Ooh. 
Look, there it goes. Hold on, I know we're rushing after somebody, but I have to collect stuff. on the trail wait there was loot don't usually collect things, do they? Solus's dagger is special. They might have been drawn to it. Stagger and takedowns. Perform takedowns with E. Damage enemies to fill their stagger meter once full enemies are staggered. Okay.
Did you find the dagger? I don't think these darkspawn took it. Let's keep looking. I need healing. Done. Thank you. Okay. Over there, our dagger thief. Ugh, more blight in the way. Ugh, and there's probably another one. Okay, hold on. Um. Okay. Whoop. Okay, that was pointless. Oh, sorry. Whoop. <laughs> Nicely done. I mean, it's gross, but you can't argue with results. from a distance. Look at that. Cool. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Is that it? Or here? Ah! Uh. 
The music just decided to... Okay, it's just starting and stopping. That's fine, I guess. Ooh! Sure. Good work. Now let's see what's behind that gate. Oh shit. Nice move. Thank you. Dying. <laughs> Please heal me. That one, that one. Yeah. Ooh, yes. Wow, fancy. still has the dagger I'm gonna save I don't know I just feel like saving is a nice idea Okay. <laughs> Lyrium. 
parting? I... Okay, goodbye. This is the eternal hymn, the prayer and the proclamation. All right. You got magic. Sick. Are you moving those rocks? I don't know. I don't know how to control it. Primers and detonators. Combine primers and detonators to trigger detonation. Some abilities apply a particular primer. All right. Okay. Use Harding's Shred ability. Have any healing? Nice. Hey, hey, hey. Watch it. They're hitting us from afar. 
Off back. We should get back. We'll talk it through there. Your pet has failed, sister. And now the magic of the Dreadwolf Stagger is hidden from me. Fen Harrell meddles once again. If his stagger is beyond our reach, we must craft another. Made of red Lyrium. Ooh. You said something took you over. Mm, something like that. And it's still with you. Y yes, I think so. It can't be possession, can it? I doubt it. Dwarves can't be possessed. They aren't connected to the Fade. Solus's dagger triggered this event. But how? Or why? I'm sorry, Lace. I wish I had answers. It's all right. Talking has helped. And hey, we got the dagger, right? Mission accomplished. Dwarves have never used magic. We can't. I think it's a gift. It is a wonderful gift. You must be proud. But I didn't do anything to earn this. How could I be proud? I don't even know how it happened. It's all a little strange. But not in a bad way. I feel... Connected to to the to the stone. Dwarves call ourselves children of the stone. Some of us have what we call stone sense. Those that have it can feel caves, lyrium veins, and faults in the rock. I wasn't one of them. Maybe the dagger unlocks something hidden. But but this is more than the stone sense I know. I hope you're right that this is a gift. <sighs> I'd be heartbroken if it caused problems. Just makes your dream. As long as you're throwing rocks at the bad guys and not me. Don't give me a reason to then. No promises. I'll send word to the Grey Wardens about the blight we saw. And then I'm gonna lie down. And we need more answers about what the gods are planning. I'll find some place to relax and try to reach Solus in the Fade. Good luck. Try not to let him get to you. It feels like we're finally making some progress. And I'm not sure what my new magic's about, but I know it feels right. Oh. With their eyes on the Dreadwolf and the gods he'd set loose. They couldn't see their own personal demons coming to haunt them. Harding told herself it felt right. She was connected to the stone, to the lost titans, and all of dwarven history with its buried secrets. How could that be anything but good? Oh shit! What does that mean?
I'm pressing Y, okay? Enemy of my enemy. Yes, I should find some place to try to talk to Solus. Varric? Varric, where are you? Oh, hey. Oh, he's just sleeping. Okay. Appearance. Okay, so I'll keep that, I guess. That's also cool. I'm going to make my shoulders a bit more narrow. Feel like they're too wide right now. At least that's how it looks. It looks fine here, but it uh, with the clothing it looks a bit more weird. Toldar, it's a tuno. Vedan gar Velos Atreidum. But Velos Atreidum is, is nothing like Isatuno. Isatuno. I remember. After you touched the dagger, the prayer, the proclamation. Isatuno. W what exactly are you proclaiming? They don't remember. No one remembers. We don't even know what we lost. You lost me. Harding? Are you in there? I'm sorry, what? Uh, what does Isatunol actually mean? Isatunol is an affirmation, a statement of existence, of... of being. It means, I am here. But no, not... not I. I is singular, but it isn't. We either. Hmm. We is multiple, but also separate. Uh, what? <sighs> is the Tunal is the eternal hymn that encompasses all time. All spaces. I am, we are, this and that, here, there, now, and forever. Right, yeah. Okay. Whatever works for you. Words aren't enough. It's, it's hard to put into words something you just feel. I'm certain Isatunal describes how we, the dwarves, once were. But none of the books say anything about it. None of the histories are right. If we forgot something so important, what else did we forget? I don't know. I'm sorry. I, I, I don't expect you to have an answer. Th thanks for letting me babble, by the way. Anytime. That's what I'm here for.
Arden approves. will note packing list oh that's Belara's room yeah where is um Neve here hello Somewhere close by is also. Oh, she's downstairs. Okay. Oh shit! What the fuck? Music room. What? Cool. never seen an alluvium like this before not intact anyways fascinating hmm I bet I don't think. Wow. Never Harding must have put my pack here. Makes sense. Better place to sleep than the infirmary. Guess I can spare a few moments to unpack my things. his life lessons I asked him how we were supposed to stop Solus, and he gave me this take a long hard look in it kid it'll always show the face of a hero who can <laughs> get it done what I don't get it That two options? That two's mother to us elves. The Valasleen are sacred for the elves. I didn't grow up Dalish, but they're not the only ones who have a claim on being elven. My tattoos represent who I am, and I'll wear that for all the world to see. No, I want more. What? No! What's up, Mike? Oh, come on, man. Ah. Oh. 
A peddler gave me this after I saved his caravan from bandits. He told me the scroll went back to even before Tevinter. Said that elves had a rich history even more than the rest of us. We also face prejudice. Too many humans look down on us, even though elves were here first. Nice to have someone see how much our people have done. I helped a lot of Minrath's slaves escape to freedom the night I met Varric. Then the Magisters cracked down in retaliation, and the Shadow Dragons decided I was too much trouble to keep around. My character is having a moment, okay? I made the right call. We could have taken a stand and dared the Magisters to come after us. At least people are free because of what I did. The tools every professional scoundrel needs when learning the trade. I spent as much time picking locks and mixing poisons as I did training with blades or a bow. Those were the days. That precision, every reagent measured perfectly, the feel of the lock opening, mm, it all just felt right. Right, that's better. Now, how do I connect a solace? Just sleep or relaxing? Maybe if I clear my mind. This is the moment when your companions went by the room and start a concerned emergency meeting about you. Now it's normal, don't worry about it. Look, fish. Yes, it is. I do this every day. Back so soon. It must have been worse than I had thought. Hello, Dreadwolf. Ah, but perhaps I am mistaken. You may be here to correct me. To tell me that my concerns were unfounded. I am, after all, remembered as the god of lies, treachery, and rebellion. Seriously, rubbing it in. So you're going to be insufferable about it. See, this is the reason nobody likes you. I led a rebellion for centuries that culminated in the creation of the Vale and the destruction of the Elven Empire. Okay, this is among the reasons nobody likes you. My information was accurate. Now you realize that the danger is real. I need to know what the gods are planning. You are asking for knowledge no mortal in this world is privy to. If I am to share it with you, I need to know what makes you the right person to lead the fight against Algonan and Gelanain. I'm not in charge. I'm not in charge of everyone. I'm just leading my little team until Varric is back on his feet. I understand your fear. Declare yourself the leader, and others may think you power-hungry. No better than those you oppose. I didn't say I was afraid. I met Varric when he asked the Shadow Dragons for help with freeing an old friend from Venatory Slavers. The Shadow Dragons had a safe plan that wasn't going to work. So you and Varric led an armed rebellion and dealt a devastating blow to the Venatori. How'd you know that? You helped Varric pursue me for the better part of a year. It would have been foolish not to learn about who was hunting me. Then you know I'm not interested in a fancy title. But when something needs doing, I do it. I suppose I was not so different when I started. Started what? My rebellion against the Evanuris. The Elven Gods, as you call them. They wish to reclaim their dominion over this world. To accomplish that, they will need two things. First, the Blight. What exists in this world is a bare fragment of its power. The rest is imprisoned. Until they release it. Why Blight the world? I don't understand. Elgernon and Gilanane were elves like you, right? Why would they want to blight the world? It is my fault. As the Dread Wolf, I was a thorn in their side. 
When my efforts weakened their grasp on the elven people, they grew frustrated, then desperate. And turned to the Blight. Once the corruption took hold of them, they were blind to its horror. It was just another source of power for them. Now they would blight the world without hesitation and call us backward and foolish for opposing them. It's bigger than what we have? The rest of the Blight is imprisoned? There's more than what's in the world already? Yes. Centuries ago, the Magisters of Devinta opened my prison. A tiny fragment of the Blight escaped. That fragment grew beneath the earth and led to the Blights that have swept across the world. However terrible the Blight is now, it is a mere fraction of what we will see if its full power is unleashed. The Blight didn't escape with the gods? Elganan and Gilanane escaped largely empty-handed, fortunately. Most of the Blight is still trapped in the prison I created ages ago. So what we saw at that village, that's them not at full strength? Correct. Wow. Can we stop them? But we can stop them from freeing the Blight, right? They will need to pierce the veil to reach the Blight's prison. My Lyrium Dagger is one of the few artifacts capable of doing so. We've already recovered it from the ritual site. Excellent. Then they will have to make their own. That will give you time. You said the gods needed two things, and the Blight is the first. What's the second? Followers. They have called themselves gods. And what is a god without worshippers to sing their praises? I'm not gonna bend a knee to blighted murdering monsters just because their ears are pointed like mine. I don't think many other elves are going to either. Agreed. Elganan and Gilanane care little for the elves. They will find worshippers among those hungry for power. Tyrants and bullies. The cruel and the corrupt, who fear their own vulnerability and seize any chance to feel strong. If you hunt them, they will lead you to Elganan and Gilanane. Sounds entertaining. <laughs> you want me to pick fights with tyrants and bullies? Sounds fun. I gave no orders. All I offer are suggestions. I'm on it. What else? The Veravas, the lighthouse Saluvian, can take you anywhere. If you master its secrets. Have you done so? Not yet, but we've got one of the Veil Jumpers working on it. She'll get it sorted and we'll see how it goes. Yes. I suppose we will. And when you speak with Varric, please tell him that I... Regret what happened. Aww. Wardrobe. Cool. Sad boy. Hey, how you doing? Wardrobe. Yes. I have nothing new, so why are you telling me I have new stuff? This... How's it hanging? It's four hours of the stream card creator. No, it's... Uh, we... It took us one hour to create our character. So it wasn't that bad. <laughs> Enter decoration mode. Saints Decor? Saints Decor? Wow! Wow! Oh, I guess you can find more stuff as you play. Cool. Neat. How are you doing, Luna? Varric! So Solus told the truth about the gods. You heard? It's bad, Varric. If you had seen Demeta's crossing... The team needs to act fast. And it can't do that with me leading from a bed. You've got to take point on this. I can't replace you. I can't do what you do. 
I've barely been holding it together in the short time you've been out. You don't need to do what I do. You just need to get it done. Rook, when I put this team together, what did I look for? A detective to find the Dreadwolf, and a scout to get us the lay of the land. Exactly the people he'd expect me to recruit. Disciplined. Predictable. And then there's you. Remember when we first met, kid? You risked your neck to bring down an entire slavery ring. Pretty much by yourself. I had help. Sure. <laughs> I got winded about five minutes in. You did most of the work. Ticked off a bunch of Menrath as big shots, but you've got a knack, kid. For what? Finding a way through the wildest shit I've ever seen. With a plan that no one expects. On the best day of his life, Solus wouldn't see you coming, Rook. And don't worry. I'll still be here to talk if you need me. About Solus and the ritual. There is something. Did Nev tell you about me talking to Solus in the Fade? I had some good arguments with Chuckles back in the day. I can't imagine being stuck with him in my head. But how are you feeling about it? We need his help. It doesn't matter how I feel about it. We can't stop the gods without what he knows. And there you go. You don't have to love him to deal with him. He also asked me to tell you that he regrets what happened. Hurting you, I mean. Chuckles is sentimental. He could burn the world down. The thing that would make him cry is a single flower with blackened petals. About Nev being hurt. When I took over at the ritual site, I had to make a call on who came with me to knock over that statue. It was the first decision I made leading this team, and Nev got hurt because of it. You made a decision with the best information you had. Sometimes you do that, and people end up hurt. Or worse. What would you have done? What would I have done? Probably gotten myself killed and failed to stop the ritual if you hadn't stepped in. A good leader isn't someone who never makes mistakes. It's someone who admits when they make one. That's how you earn their trust. Mando is on the bed, uh, chilling. She's staring at me because I haven't given her enough attention today. <laughs> because I've been playing and I have to work. Yeah. Demetta's crossing was awful. While we were there, we found one survivor, the mayor. You took him back to the Veil Jumpers. Not everyone was happy about my decision. We're just starting out and I'm already losing their trust. The key to earning the team's trust isn't to only make decisions everyone agrees with. It's showing the team that they can tell you whatever's on their mind, even if they think you're full of crap. And know you'll listen. Talk to you later. I'll let you get some rest. You're gonna be fine, Rook. Uh, hey, one last thing before you go. I've been racking my brain thinking of contacts who might help us with these gods. You got any ideas? Nothing. But being a leader isn't about having all the answers yourself. It's about knowing who does. Nev has connections to a whole world that Harding and I barely know. Might be worth talking to her. Will do. Thanks, Varric. Anytime. Varric is the best. I love him very much. <laughs> you can stop fussing over me. Go see what the others are up to. No, I want to fuss over you. Hey, Nev. Hi, Wisps. Yeah, they're still here, but you're here for leads. You want allies to go after the gods? I've got places to look, if we can get anywhere but all of them. Valara's working on it. What have you got? Let's start with the angles we know. The gods are corrupt magic personified. Who do we hire to fight that? Mages. First, the Antivan Crows. Oh. 
You want to fight gods with assassins? Not just any assassin. Their most feared mage killer, the demon of Virantium. The mage killer isn't the problem. Working with a feared mage killer doesn't bother you? If he doesn't have a contract out on me, it's not a problem. I know you want to bank the vampire looking dude. Who's your second fave? Uh, do you mean vampire looking dude? Is he? Does he look like a vampire? <laughs> if we're thinking of the same guy. Also, uh, if you look up the guy named Darvis, Darwin or Darvis, da I think Darwin. Uh, he's a Grey Warden. I might go for him, depending on who clicks. Think we'll get along? You think a train killer will like us? What's not to love? The demon got his nickname taking out blood mages and venatori. From everything I've learned, the reputation was earned. I never uncovered his real name, and there's been fewer stories the last few years. But the crows would know. I can set a meeting with their bosses. Let's give it a try. Time to make new friends. We'll see if it works. You said the crows were first. What's next? A trip home. Back to Minrathis. Capital city and heart of Tevintir. An empire of mages that knows a thing or two about corrupt magic. And who fights the worst of it? The shadow dragons. Good idea. Mm. Resist the gods with our own resistance group. If the gods enter the empire, our contacts back home might get something. About our past work. Years with the Shadow Dragons, and this is the first time we've worked together. Directly. I gather information for the Shadows. You might have used one of my leads. And I've heard of you. I bet everyone heard about the Nessus job. You were right to avoid Minrathus after. More than one Magister wanted your head. It was good work, though. And we've got more ahead. I miss the Shadow Dragons. You know, I miss the other shadows. Or I do when I get a second to think. How many of those have you had? I don't know. Five. Sounds about right. So, we talked to the crows in Antiva and the shadow dragons in Minrathis. I wouldn't mind checking in on my neighborhood either. If Valar is ready for us. Yeah, should check how things are going. Okay. Sea of Blood. things aren't they reflections they distort reality no matter what you try ah. and there's a the trick control that distortion <laughs> guess it's the fade another part of it i mean didn't morrigan say this alluvian could go anywhere didn't think that meant elsewhere in the fade she called it the fear of us freedom of ways i wonder is it safe if that is the fade on the other side won't it be dangerous as the fade often is more dangerous than elven gods who wield the blight as a weapon point taken some of the older texts talk about a place in the Fade where all the Alluvians meet. A crossroads where you could travel across all of Thetis in just minutes. Right. We saw something similar when we were chasing Solus. I wonder if it's the same. It is alike. 
And it is not. Nitric? Either you found some way to get into the lighthouse without us seeing, or you've been here all along. Not sure which one worries me more. The wolf's fang. You carry it now. Old paths. A new journey through there. I will wait. All right. Well, can't tell if that's a trap or not, but we're short on options. One way to find out. And it didn't feel dangerous, you know? Almost more sad. Two aren't exclusive. Just because something's sad doesn't mean it isn't dangerous. I can think of an example or two that proves that. And we still don't know what this Alluvian's gonna do. One of us should probably stay behind in case it closes. Good point. Just tell us when you're ready to go, Rook, and then we can figure out what's going on. All right, let's go. Any standout voice acting so far? Uh, honestly, no, except for Varric, because Varric is always amazing. His voice is great. And Solas, uh, we know him from the previous game. His voice acting is also very good. Other than that, uh, nothing has impressed me so far. Stuart, I knew that. Oh, the crossroads. Right. Of course. The Evanurus hunger for the crossroads, their influence is spreading. Blight, death, madness, they send their minions to claim this place. The crossroads is in a time of need, Dweller. I cannot protect you. You don't have to. If you're standing against the gods, then consider us reinforcements. Okay. I can leave. <laughs> Just leave. Okay, let me start a new recording. 